everybody, this is Marcy Super and the Marcy Super Channel, and today we have another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle for you to sit here and enjoy. If you guys like Pokemon Wi-Fi battles, make sure you hit the like button and show your boy some love. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. <laughs> guys, 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 how are you doing today though? Like, I'm legit seeing craziness already. This is like try hard city for this guy. Which is cool because I was looking for a really good competitive match to kind of close off Mega, um, the Mega Mall Wild team. So let's see if we can get a victory in today. Like, I, I'm not sure though. Like, that team was a buff. But we might be able to get some wins out if we, um, get a lot of our hazards out early. I'm kind of sad that I don't have priority to deal with Faramosa. But well, we are going to start with Saliva, Saliva and we see Hippowdon. Okay. We see him whip up the trans stream. Sandstorm got kicked up. I'm kind of sad because I... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh! Okay, We that works for me. That works. Ah, <laughs> uh, we see the Magirna. We shoot off a try attack. I think a Thunderbolt would have been good. But good thing we did not shoot off the Ice Beam. Maybe we'll get a status. But we don't. We see them in a pretty early, guys. I'm going to send off Amazing. Just because Amazing might have the best um, matchup right now. Unless we get hit with a Fairy Move and then I'm going to take neutral damage. But I'm going to set up the Rocks right now. Because there are a lot of frail Pokemon on this team. We do see the Aura Sphere pretty early. So we are going to take reduced damage from that. Amazing is going to get some leftover support and Sandstorm is not going to affect them so much. So, I think this is good right now. We get this up. The only Pokemon on this team that really, uh, is that a second misclick? Oh God, I misclicked twice. Oh god. I mean it grabs us the KO. <laughs> it super grabs us the KO right now. But I wasn't looking forward to that. I was trying to set up rocks. I mean, but that's one less Pokemon to deal with. We see Hippowdon come out. Which kind of makes me not super um wary. Hippowdon could carry ice um ice fang. But I'm pretty sure he's just going to set up his rocks right now. None of my Pokemon really want to take rocks that much. But maybe if we can get um, my wild set up, we could attempt to sweep. Once again, uh, the biggest threat on this team is Faramosa. Everything else is just kind of just not something I want to deal with. We are going to start off the knockoff, get whatever Hippodon has on it off. And we do see a Toxic. We do get to avoid it. Sandstorm has subsided. So we can't get a U-turn off right now. Get a little more basic damage off real quick. I can shut off Ice Beams right now. And it wouldn't be too detrimental to me. The real problem that I have right now is that I'm not trying to deal with... Um... Fair most of so much. We do see the EQ. If Slayer dies right now, we could just party shot later. That's a lot of damage. I'm gonna Ice Beam. Maybe he'll decide to switch out. But Slayer, like, my Slayers are just on point. Ugh. Okay. We are gonna get the Hip Hop on knocked out, which is pretty good early game. It's a really big tank. We might force the switch out right now. We might force the switch out right now. Or we might just get the KO and probably switch out later. Yeah. So, we do get the switch out kind of early. Slayer, I'm going to have to switch out Slayer right now because I do want to use the Z parting shot later. Oh, it's fair. Mosa doesn't show up and try to wreck face. Fair Mosa are so versatile right now. Like, see? 
We're gonna just have to just try to go kill. She has such a low, um... If this is Quiver Dance... Okay, we see the Rapid Spin. Which is cool. I'm cool with it. And we see as Ice... Um, we do see that it is um, Life Orb. But it's just so... Boo-boo stat that we just knock it out after an Ice Beam. If Slayer somehow survives us, we're just gonna switch out. Nah. So we don't be able to get our Z party shot off. We do kind of trade in a lot of Pokemon for a lot of like some fuckery. But all he has left now is Charizard, which I'm gonna reset up rocks now because of that. Because we're gonna have to hope that it doesn't get too many um, Dragon Dances off. We go with Amazing. I'm expecting a switch out right now. I'm gonna try to take advantage of the switch out. Set up Stealth Rocks. Cause Zerkatry is not gonna stay in. What? Zerkatry stays in? Z Hypnosis? Yeah, Z Hypnosis. Which isn't something I wanna deal with. Z Hypnosis can still miss. But it doesn't. So, that's cool. Amazing sleep. We might see a tail glow right now, but we could easily negate that with, um, with, um, uh, Garchomp. We took out the only fairy on his team. So we do see the tail glow. I will say this, I'd much rather lose, I'd much rather get a free turn out and missing an EQ. Really? Okay. Okay. So like I said, I'd much rather have um, miss EQ and have him switch out to Charizard than... Half its HP. I really hope this is a physical Charizard. <laughs> oh man. I really hope this is a physical Charizard. Because I have no priority on this team. We do see Dragon Ant, so it might not be Mega just yet. Which I'm kind of not super scared of. Because we do have Intimidation in two forms. You know what, while I'm at it, I'm just going to sack off uh, Lady Fortuna. Because Lady Fortuna doesn't do anything in this matchup at all. Like, we still have to deal with... Uh... Or we can just sit here and play the Intimidation game. Yeah, so he's gonna try to Dragon Dance uh, past my Intimidation. Which is cool. Mega Shikai. Mega Shikai! I really want a Swords Dance. So we do see the Mega Evolution. We are not going to survive I mean, this kind of works. We're not outspeeding it. We're definitely not outspeeding it. And he's at a neutral attack. So we do see the Flare Blitz. I'm, I'm completely cool with this. I'm completely cool with this. Because now he's gonna lose all that recoil damage. And unless he has a Roost, which I really don't think he does, it should be an easy. It should be easy. So we know he's we we know he's faster. We know he's faster. I don't know. If this is the Garchomp with um 
rough skin. And looking at the rest of the team, EQ isn't a bad, isn't bad to go with. We do see the Dragon Claw. Ugh, even at a plus so one. That's a lot of that's a lot of damage. I don't know if he has Roost. And that's the issue. I wanna I wanna vote switch so bad. But I need Mazing to wake up eventually. <laughs> I'm gonna both switch out. Cause unless that um Yeah, he only has two Pokemon left. And we still have three. We still have Tapu Lele. So I'm kind of happy. Tapu Lele should outspeed. Um, what is my Lele? My Lele specs or specs? Okay. So unless this, <laughs> unless um, unless this is Proteant, Proteant, um, Gunk Shot, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Greninja. We should be good. We're not gonna be able to take advantage of psychic terrains. Cool. Just for just for just for the simple fact, we go for the fairy stat. Hoping Kazo. We see the dark post, which is gonna be neutral damage. Yes, and Tapu Lele is going to get the moon blast off. Hopefully, that should be enough to knock out uh, Greninja. And we're clutching the win today, boys. So that was lovely, lovely, lovely. So guys, if you guys like this Wi-Fi battle, make sure you hit your boy with that like button. Show your boy some love. Comment, rate, subscribe, guys. Uh, I'm going to have a couple things for you guys for later in the week. I promise not to leave y'all hanging like I've been lately. But we're going to start doing this. So, comment, rate, subscribe. This is Mars King Super on the Mars King Super Channel. And the Mars is out.